Hi, Tom Varsi, Military Embedded Systems. I'm at Exponential 2024 in San Diego, California. I'm at the RTI booth with uh, John Breitenbach. How are you, John? I'm doing good, Tom. How are you? Good I'm to see you again. Yeah, good to see you again. So John's going to tell us about what RTI is showing at Exponential and in the autonomous space. And, and uh, go ahead, tell me what, you're, what, what you guys are showing. Yeah, so one message that we've heard from senior leadership, not just here, but basically at every event that we've been uh, in last years, is what a disruptive force unmanned systems are, um, both uh, on the offensive side, but also how to counter them on the defensive side. And so our U.S. Uh, military leadership and our allied leadership, are, are, you know, realize that we need to innovate quickly on both fronts, on both the offensive front and the defensive front. Um, and so we believe that that future for unmanned systems is um, software defined, standards based and data centric. And we think that those three attributes are the things that are going to allow us to innovate quickly on both the offensive and defensive side uh, for this disruptive technology. So when we say um, software defined, that means that we're separating the payloads from the platforms. Um, we can think of the hardware uh, as, as almost fungible, right? Once, once we have a technology like an autonomy algorithm, it really shouldn't matter what type of platform that we put it on. So we want to be able to innovate quickly and, and uh, software defined systems allow us to do that by adding new life to existing hardware by just updating the software. So that's the first big attribute. And of course, to make all the software and hardware components work together, you need standards. And we believe that open international standards are the way to go. Uh, standard based design is what's going to allow you to innovate quickly um, and to integrate uh, quickly and, and get all these different components to work together as one. And then finally, this concept of data centricity, where data is the central asset in the system. Um, and that allows us to treat the data as a first class citizen uh, in the system. It's the most important asset as applications come and go, as hardware comes and goes and gets upgraded. It's really the data that we're trying to share that our senior leadership needs uh, in order uh, to, to prosecute their mission that um, is the most important thing. And we have found over time in some long running military systems that when you have a data centric design, um, it actually tends to be very easy to upgrade over time, uh, uh, much better than systems that are not based data centrically. So RTI, we have a complete sweat of, uh, set of tools. We are based on an open international uh, standard called data distribution service. Um, so we are standards based. We allow you to build software defined systems. We allow you to do it quickly. We have a, a complete ecosystem. Uh, of tools, uh, including integrations with some of the latest GoFast technologies like model-based systems engineering, like modern game engines. Uh, we can tie all of that together and uh, help you develop unmanned systems quickly. Mm. RTI is certainly a leader in this entire area. Uh, John, tell people how they can get more information about RTI and, and all the products that you offer. Yeah, so go to RTI.com uh, and you'll find information on all the markets that we're in, both military as well as commercial. Great. Thanks, yep. John. Yep, thanks, Sam. Yep.